Hi guys, it is Dr. Stacy Francis here and I want to talk to you about magnesium again because we're going to enter into gut health month. This month we're going to talk about gut and skin health and the reason we're going to talk about magnesium is because remember those three magnesium we talked about is one, magnesium glycinate. It's the best magnesium to get into your muscles and help with anxiety and things like that helps you sleep at night, but really it's for every biochemical process you have and helps with um, muscle relaxation. Number two, magnesium L-threonate crosses the blood-brain barrier and helps with cognitive function, memory, um, helps with anxiety, mood disorders, and migraines and headaches. So important to take magnesium L-threonate for things like that. The other one is magnesium oxide. It only helps you poop. That's all it does. It does not absorb. It actually pulls water from into the colon so that you can have a bowel movement. And I promise you that if you are constipated, this is a really great thing to try. Magnesium oxide, we like MAGO7 in our office and two before bed con consistently is really gentle on the body. It's not addictive. It really helps you poop every day. It's really good. And you want to poop every day because it's so important to not have hard stool in your colon. Fiber oftentimes will not help enough because it will cause more backup along the way. And once again, you're just not able to have a bowel movement. And when the colon expands from all that waste matter in there, it makes it even harder to poop later on. So you want to have a bowel movement every day. You want it to be easy. You want it to um, be formed well and no strain so that there's no hemorrhoids, no fissures, no problem, right? So make sure you're taking your magnesium. You're taking the kinds of magnesium you need. Yes, you can take magnesium oxide and magnesium glycinate and magnesium l 3 and 8 You can take all of them. Um, but if you need to have a bowel movement, make sure you're taking magnesium oxide or something else that's going to help you. Some people benefit from more fiber. Some people do not. Who are you? What works for you? Figure that out. I'm here to help. So give me a call if you need me and um, we'll figure all this out. We're going to enter into gut and skin health month. Remember, your skin is just the outside of your colon, so in your intestinal lining. So when there is any skin problems, hives, uh, blemishes, acne, um, eczema, unresolved rashes, whatever, remember, it starts in the gut. We need to heal the gut first, and then we can heal the skin. And we're going to talk all about that this month. So watch for newsletters if you're not on our newsletter list. Go to our website, specificwellness.com. Sign up for our newsletter. You'll get all that. And we're going to have another challenge this month. We're going to have um, tips and tricks on how to help you heal. And it's going to be great. Talk to you soon. Bye.